Hey, what up, guys? This is Sedson, and today we are going to take a look at the thin blue line flag and some of its variations. All of these flags are made to honor police officers, something that is very near and dear to my own heart since my grandfather and his father before him were both officers of the law. In fact, my great-grandfather was murdered while on duty, so these flags are a great reminder to me of him and of all police officers and the sacrifices they make to keep the rest of us safe. The original flag is a blue line on a black background. The line represents that thin line between a secure and orderly society and one that is lawlessness and complete anarchy. The blue color of the line represents the individual officer and his or her courage as he or she defends the stability of the line. The black represents all of the fallen officers who have died in the line of duty. This flag design originated in the United Kingdom, where its second iteration was also made. This version is a Union Jack in black and white with a thin blue line running across its center. This was later adapted to the American flag, which is the flag that you see here. In this version of the design, the black stripe above the blue line stands for the innocent people of America, while the bottom black stripe represents the criminals who wish to cause harm to the people. In between the two stands the police officer, ever ready to intervene. This flag design has become popularized in the United States after five Dallas police officers were gunned down and murdered in an ambush attack on July 7, 2016. Despite its rising popularity, the flag is also somewhat controversial, as it is believed by some people to be a desecration of the American flag and in violation of the United States flag code. That said, the difference between the two flags is simply a changing of the colors on the flag. For all intents and purposes, this is the same as the subdued flag patches worn by our military personnel when deployed. I'll let you make your own decision, but I doubt very many would call that desecration since our own military issues them and mandates their use. In any case, the thin blue line flags remain as a strong reminder of the honor and dignity of police officers and of their importance to the communities they serve and to any civilized society. An interesting side note, the term the thin blue line comes from another term, the thin red line, which refers quite literally to the thin red line of uniforms on the horizon formed by a group of British soldiers making a defensive line at the 1854 Battle of Balaclava. Well, I hope you enjoyed this look at this interesting flag design. This is Sedson, signing off.